Get wrecked, Blob. Get Prepare your holes, baby. Like, they can leave the pirate and I won't be that upset, but it's just kind of like, if they're gonna change classes, if they're willing to change classes, I don't see why they wouldn't want to do something for the pirate here. Get wrecked. I'll right, we'll try one more, but we don't have a lot of time. Stones get plus one plus two. You can discard an additional. That sounds really good. Heal six when reloading. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, Crucible. Uh, you have to beat it, beat the game once first still. on uh plain difficulty or whatever it's a stupid encounter where they give me one bomb on the first it's such a weird first encounter compared to how they do some other ones hmm this is playing because i have to beat the game once still to get into crucible All right, now we can blow the bomb. <sighs> oh, wait. Ooh. For some reason, I thought the last blue slime was coming out. Oh, well, whatever. Close enough. Oh, okay. Boop, 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 boop. Hmm. Two discards. Interesting. So we could go for a lot of orbs again this time, and it would actually work better. You don't need to worry about removals as much and stuff. Ba -bam. Okay. All right. No. Oh, come on. Game inspired the tutorial command. Ha. Huh. That's a good question. I don't remember. Horrible. I think refresh orb is not very good either. I guess we'll go for that. Oh, it was Deathloop? Oh, it might have been Deathloop. Yeah, that sounds about remember. Or the rat game. I think it was discussed in the rat game, because I remember I got stuck in the tutorial for like a couple minutes. Hey, Gazal. Yeah, Deathloop had like a really long tutorial. So I get a Bramble Ball if I reach in. Oh, a level three Bramble. Ball. Ooh. That's definitely worth 10 HP. Okay. Yeah, Deathloop had like a really long tutorial. <laughs> and I was like uh, very confused because uh, I didn't really know what the game was going to be like. It's like one of those things like I thought it was going to be this type of game and it turns out it wasn't. And it was, it's kind of hard to know when to bounce, like, because I don't want, I want to leave as many surprises for the game as possible, but it does mean that I, I might be surprised in bad ways, too. I can't get both mini bosses. And that doesn't matter that much. Question mark first, I guess. <laughs> Turns out it's about incest. True. <laughs> Bombs deal plus 10. Bombs clear nearby pegs when detonated. Stones get plus one, plus two. Huh. Which one do I want? I don't know. It's a tough one, actually. I guess we'll see what happens. Okay, well. 
Not what I wanted. Well, wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. Well, I guess we're taking bomb steel plus 10. Dun, 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 dun. Go to the right. Go to the right. Oh, my God. That's such bullshit. That's not fair. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Okay. Good enough. <sighs> I kind of watched the game called 12 Minutes, which unfortunately has time loop and incest too. What? Is Polter of Geist just cheating? Well, I kind of just want to clear the game also. It's way too good. They changed Ball Lightning a little bit, apparently. It sounded like a buff. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Back to the Future had, like, weird incestuous things going on, too. Why do they always focus on that? It's like, you couldn't think of anything better? Go back in time, become your own dad? Even that show Dark, I think some shit like that happened. I can't totally remember now, though. Futurama 2? Oh, right! Alright, so don't use this. Because I'm probably not going to get it back. I need to upgrade it. Well, this is like an actual nightmare here. All right, the crits opened up at least for Poltorb guys, I suppose. Kind of overkill, I'd say. Really need this to deal a lot of damage, please. 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 <laughs> Get a crit. Do something! That did not deal a lot of damage. Oh, no. My spooky friend. Oh, uh, shit. Sex with myself from another dimension. Uh, probably not. Like, I don't really find myself particularly, like, sexy or something. And this isn't me, like, trying to be down on myself, but just, like, honestly. Like, if I saw myself in the street, I wouldn't be like, I gotta get me a piece of that Elmer's glue ass or something like that. You know what I mean? It doesn't really get me, get the juices, fl juices flowing, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, hey, I'm not my own type. Yeah, that's a good way to put it, honestly. Honestly. <laughs> if I was female, probably not still. Peg bag. Board will contain two extra refreshes. Ooh. Ooh, baby. Going left. So you're saying there's a chance? Uh, I mean, I can't say it's zero percent. Okay. On build. It would have to be like a very particular scenario, though. What kind of dumpster truck ass would I have? Whenever an enemy is defeated, refresh the board. That's a lot of refreshing. Wait, that's not good. Whenever an enemy is defeated? No, it's okay. I had to think about it. 
how fast food seafood restaurants exist for one it sounds disgusting and two there are never any people there that is true isn't it isn't it what a strange world we live in i do feel like there is definitely no one ever there like red lobster there's a there i used to work like almost next to a red lobster there was no one ever there but they were always open too i swear to god i close up at 11 o'clock at night and they were still fucking open i was like what but there was never anyone there it's all a money laundering scheme probably you love red lobster I've not, I don't think I've ever eaten at a Red Lobster, to be honest. No, 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 no. Is Red Lobster fast food? I don't even know, actually. Maybe it's not considered fast food. Oh, come on, Bramball. Mass market chain, not fast food necessarily. It's a restaurant. Oh, he has to sit down and stuff. The thing is though, like if you ordered the fisherman's platter from your local pizza place, you're gonna get some seafood, that's for sure. It's probably not gonna be the freshest or the best, but they deep fry it so that you can't tell anyway, right? Like, and there's lots of ways to get seafood. But no doubt it's just, like, been frozen and they heat it up in some giant fucking microwave or something like that right before sending it out. As much as I love seafood, there's just, like, so... It's too easy to get it wrong, kind of. Right, yeah, you just gotta know, like, when, when it's okay to order. It's like, some places you just know, like, Clams Casino, you might want to pass on that one. If you're at a Red Robin or something like that. Ice Circle. Let's try the Ball Lightning, since apparently got buffed. I forgot that I have double discard. Doesn't matter where we go. Check my Coastal Privilege. What is this? Oh, duplicating orb? Level 3 Bramball. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's probably still correct. Docked orb, Orbalisk, Infern orb. I kind of don't want any of these. I don't know. Th this is just like such RNG bullshit. Hip hop, fish, and chicken? What? I don't want a docked orb. Do I want an orbalisk? I don't think so. It's only a 3-6. And I don't have any bold orbs. Skip. The thing is, though, like, even in Massachusetts, where I am probably most of the... Pretty much in my entire life, I am within an hour of the actual coast. Uh... There's still a lot of, like, traps when it comes to, like, seafood around here, sadly. It's kind of like, oh, you're near the coast, therefore all the seafood that all the restaurants serve around here is definitely going to be fresh. Like, no, 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 no. That's not true at all. <laughs> It's illegal to just, like, take a lobster out of the ocean by hand, by the way, I'm pretty sure. What's up, Dechoy? I'm pretty sure. I think my grandmother used to tell me that, at least. Like, I can't just go and pick up a lobster out of the ocean. What the fuck? Did they nerf Poltorb? Or do I just suck? Oh... 
I'd have seafood every single day if I could. Every single day. Oh wait, the stones have the buff, don't they? Eh, I don't know. Maybe chain lightning was better. It's not illegal. You just can't take whatever kind. Oh, maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Are you kidding me? How's that even possible? I guess I'm gonna do this. This is stupid. It might be kind of stupid. Can you go into it? Get in there! I lost health. Please, please. Oh my God, it's still terrible. Why are these on the bottom? Hey, Ryan. This hits me for 21, skip, skip. This is garbage. Ugh. Oh, I was targeting the mole for that, apparently. Flint hook? I think it's been brought up. I haven't tried it. Sounds really familiar. Too many games to play, not, not enough time, baby. Okay, that was pretty good. Murder the tree, beautifully done. Hey, Rose. Hey, tree. You'll take whatever lobsters you want. I guess you can't really get in trouble for it. Although my dad did take us illegally scalloping once or whatever at some beach. And he got some big ass fine over it. Hmm. I kind of wanted to check out Ball Lightning, but it kind of sounds like garbage, also. There is the Poltorb. Maybe Poltorb first. All right, durable. Electro Pignet just got a slight buff. We can try that again. Durable isn't especially good for us, I'd say. Uh, we'll try the buffed pegnet now and see what, how that is now. Mm, boom, ba -dum, boom. When you get some collard greens you're talking about and it costs 15 bucks, I've never tried it. I can't find food like that around here easily, it seems. Like, I never see it anywhere. Uh, I guess we're going left. Definitely don't need that. Do I want to try this ball lightning? Well, I guess so. Alright, so we have Electro. Probably worn up by now. There we go. Zap. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Skip the Bram Ball? Yeah, I guess we have another one after that anyway. Seems like a good idea. Oh, come on, Bram Ball! Oh, okay, well, you're coming back, you're coming back. You're not coming back. Okay. I'll use up a stone for now. The bells remind you of Futurama? Oh yeah, from the intro. It does kind of sound like that. Are you kidding? 14 short? Am I a joke to you? Okay, use the bram ball here. This lady that worked uh, at one of my previous jobs, um, she's Haitian Creole, and she brought in this like fried fish. It was like rice, but it, it, she spoke 
it pretty much no English. So uh, she didn't describe the dish, but it was so fucking good. They had all the little fish bones in there, so you had to pick them out. But my God, it's like a fried fatty fish. I think she said it was catfish, but I'm like, it doesn't look like a catfish to me, but I also am not that a fisher man, I'd say. All right, pull Torv up. Mm, we really want all the mini bosses. Let's go this way. Creole food rips, yeah. Oh man, there was a Jamaican place nearby I really wanted to try. Too, I never got to try it before I stopped working. Not that I can't go back there, but now it's like far away. You know what I mean? Whoop. It was a strange plaza where the Jamaican restaurant and the Vietnamese restaurant share the same patio and they have like their tables mixed in together, basically. <laughs> it was an interesting uh, setup they have going on. <laughs> Very like small places. Okay. Why would I go anywhere else? I know. The thing is, it was like, it was near where I worked, but it wasn't near where I live, so I never really went. About exotic foods? Jamaican me hungry. Oh my God, Ryan. How could you, Ryan? Hmm. To be ashamed of yourself. Ooh. Hold over his light, so with the, the pegnet, it's just really good, isn't it? Okay. That too, though. Woo! Uh, single target D. We'll see how the ball lightning goes. Have I had Jamaican food before, though? One time, I don't remember it other than liking it because I think I was like really young. Really young. I actually remember it. Because what happened was, I was really young. I'd say under 10 years old. And I was throwing a fit in the car with my dad. And, uh... <laughs> but he... He was, he was... He just wasn't having it that day or something. So... I was throwing a fit. I think it's because I wanted McDonald's chicken nuggies or something like that. But instead, he was taking us to this Jamaican restaurant. Yeah, don't worry. The crying's coming. And I started to cry. Yeah, the crying's coming up. Uh, so I think I threw a fit and I stayed in the car. Like, he called my bluff and he made me stay in the car while the rest of the family went in and ate without me. <laughs> but he secretly brought some home for me to eat from when we got home. <laughs> I feel like the weather vane should be weak to uh, the lightning, you know what I mean? I stayed in the car the whole time. Yeah, it was like dark out too. Cause I remember I was just sitting there sobbing quietly alone in the car <laughs> for like two hours or something. <laughs> it probably worked cause I wasn't a little bitch after that about not getting my chicken uggies probably if I were to guess. Rub orb. Extra bouncy. Uh, all orb, nothing. It's just not that good. It's basically, it's probably the same thing as the dag orb. You know what I mean? Don't really need the heal. I have double discard, so I feel like I should take something. I'll try the rub orb a little bit more. I'd like the rub orb, if you know what I'm saying. Better than how your parents would have handled it? Right. Hmm. <laughs> Sometimes it's, it's like, how, how do you teach a kid a lesson, you know? It's kind of hard. When they're being a, when they're being a fucking brat, you know what I mean? 
Hmm. He's talked sternly to him. By experience, right? I mean, I've babysat some of my nieces. And sometimes they're being little shits. They were refusing to put their shoes on. They're just, no, no. Cackling, spitting, blowing raspberries for some reason. Takes a lot of patience, that's for sure. But you, you literally can't get them to do it. It's like, I'm not the real parent even in this situation either. You know what I mean? And they're just sitting there going, spitting in my face as I'm trying to put their shoes on their stupid feet. And <laughs> it's like, what the hell do you do? Parenting stuff, you know? Kids are super mean sometimes. Yeah, they just, you know, you don't understand it. Like when we were kids too, like you didn't know like the, the effects of what you did. You know what I mean? Kid, yeah, kids don't really have like much empathy it seems. I don't know. There's some. You know what I mean? Your daughter's learned she can kick me in the crotch really easily when I'm changing her diaper. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Come on, hit the crit! Boo. Oh, there you go. <sighs> hmm. Let's try the bouncy orb. Kids are tiny sociopaths, right? It's true. And I'm sure a lot of us are the, the same age where like when I was a kid, you know, you didn't listen, you get a little smack, you know, you know, for me, at least it wasn't usually like, it wasn't going to be like a full on beating. You, know, you get a little smack or something like that. And you can't do that, though. It's probably, you know, might lead to some of the issues that I have to discuss with my therapist or something like that. But it was kind of just something that uh was accepted as like, this is kind of OK, like or something that you had to do back then, sadly. Uh, OK, we're fine. Oh, wait, it was more than enough. Hmm. A love tap, yeah. I like that how I like how uh supposedly uh I don't I forget, where is it like South America or something? The mom just takes off the sandal to, for the threat. <laughs> just for the threat. <laughs> I used to get that sometimes do too, you know, like you start crying. You start crying, and the parents are like, I'll give you something to cry about. They never really do anything. You know what I mean? They never do anything, but it's the threat that gets you. You know what I mean? Uh... Hmm. Try that. See how we do. Hmm... How can you explain reasons to them when they don't know what reasons are good and what are not? Talking about kids? I think Power Glove is just always good here, right? I don't know. I don't, I'm no expert. I haven't read any books on parenting. I know nothing about parenting. It's a. It's going to be a continue to be an empty space in my head, too. Minus 50 max HP plus special relic. We're not really set up for this. Plus, I have the Nosferator or whatever. Nosfor Batu. So, I think that's a big no. Boom, boom. They were talking about the housing market when they said they were going to give you something to cry about. <laughs> yep. <laughs> uh... Hmm. It's interesting when you're a kid, it's like, you don't think that. It's kind of like, 
you have, I don't know, at least for me, like I avoided the responsibility for so long. And now that I have so much responsibility, it's kind of like, God damn, it was so nice when I had no responsibility. <laughs> now, having said that, I've said it before and I'll say it again. Being a kid is hard on its own. You know what I mean? Being a kid is hard on its own, but for separate reasons, I think. You know what I mean? Like your brain just ain't there yet for to fathom the world. Hmm. Oh, maybe I should have just healed. Uh... You have lots of worst days ever if you haven't had a lot of days yet. Yeah, that's a good way of looking at it, actually. It's true, right? <laughs> One of my worst days ever was when that little shit Justin stole my Game Boy Game Genie on the bus on the way to school. I remember that day. Still, it was like the worst day ever. But I was not confrontational, so I didn't say anything, and he was a kind of a bully, so I was scared of him. So I just sat back and I let it happen, basically, and never told anyone. And then I was asked, where's the game genie? I'm just like, I don't know. <laughs> and then I cried. I probably cried. I don't actually remember. Worst day of your life so far. That's a good Simpsons quote. <laughs> uh... mm, what do we got here? All attacks have plus one plus zero. Not bad. One more refresh. Orb and relic battle rewards contain additional option to choose from. This shit is just like total RNG anyway. I don't, I don't know. There's no point in really thinking that hard about it. Uh... That's a good one. I like it. Still, we're like halfway through the run. I want to go to the right. We'll see if that happens. Bullying? Bullying is like, I know like it's kind of, it's considered a big deal nowadays. It always has been considered kind of a big deal, right? Like bullying has not really been an acceptable thing for a long time. But I think um, looking back on it, that shit was, is way worse than a lot of people even, uh, begin to touch on. I think bullying, even though I wouldn't have called myself severely bullied, but the small amount when it did happen was really traumatizing. Like that shit messed me up, you know? You get over it eventually to some degree, you know? But like when I have to fear just, I already hate going to school because learning is boring and the teachers suck and none of my friends in my class. Now I gotta worry about fucking Reggie giving me a, an atomic wedgie in the middle of class too now. And just being scared to go to school, which is already a scary place on a day-by-day -day basis is like the worst thing. It's like the worst thing. Right? It's not an easy problem to solve. It's not, yeah. And there was definitely times where, like, I probably wasn't very kind to some kids, too, and I, like... And I feel supremely bad about it. I would like to think I was never, like, a clinical bully or anything like that, but honestly, how they perceived it, I'm not really sure. It's hard to really remember, especially from an, ob an objective point of view, you know? Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Kids having the power trips? Yeah. It's sort of just the sense of humor that kids have to a degree, too. That's like a massive problem. Like, shitty things happening to people is funny to a lot of kids, sadly. Right? I was both bullied and bullied others at times. Yeah, that's the thing. It kind of it can perpetuate itself. I've heard, you know, you get bullied. So what happens is you're like, well, you don't want to be bullied. So therefore you're going to be the bully, right? 
that's what happens because you don't want to be bullied so you're going to bully someone else so people are going to see that you have the upper hand and it kind of perpetuates itself right i'm not sitting here saying well that means it's okay to bully or anything like that it's not going that far obviously but ah we have double d card huh we don't have a ton to upgrade left either you know Bam, bam, bum, bum, bum. Hmm, what do I want? I don't have durable or anything. That's extra dense, so it probably doesn't really work out. I feel like that's not great. Maybe the Echo Orb? Maybe. Maybe it's okay. I don't know. Hmm. But yeah, honestly, I could see it like, uh... I, I remember the times, the like few times where like the bullying like kind of stood out for me and stuff. And it really shaped who I was, especially in like high school and stuff, because it made me more withdrawn and stuff. Hmm. So that's that's how you like I can tell like that shit was important in a way, in a bad way. Hmm. Well, I guess I'm skipping that. Double skipperoo. It definitely wasn't bad, but I remember like I think I told this story before. And it's hard to look at this from the sense, like, because I understand from the kids' point, I don't totally blame at least some of the kids, but it was really fucking annoying. I'm in class whistling. The English teacher walks in. I don't know. It's like middle school, so between sixth and eighth grade or something like that. So it's kind of like around the time that a lot of kids are hitting puberty and stuff. So, and I'm whistling, and the English teacher watch in, walks in, and that fucking kid, Mike, says... Did Danny just whis uh, whistle at the teacher? Danny likes the teacher. Danny thinks the teacher's sexy. And that became like a theme for like the rest of the class for the rest of the year. And I absolutely hated it for the rest of the year. It was a nightmare. I hated it so much. I couldn't stand it. <laughs> and I'm like, no, I didn't do that. But, you know, Danny likes the teacher. And, like, you think it's not a big deal. But I hated it. And I hated seeing those kids after that, you know? It's the worst. All right, Bram Ball. I can look back and laugh about it now. It's not like my life was ruined or anything about it. But, yeah, it's kind of like even small things like that can be really annoying, you know? Oh, it's immune to Bramball. Oh, that's not good. I guess that makes sense here. The bystanders. I do remember at least one time. It wasn't even that big of a deal. But this kid who was like a bully to everybody came up to me and said something. I don't even know what. And this upperclassman who was just sitting next to me randomly told him to go like fuck himself or something. And that made it, that was kind of a big deal to me because it prevented a possible bullying. You know what I mean? Like the people who stood up, you know, I mean, that's kind of how you gotta, that's probably the best course to raise the kids is to, you know, it's hard to prevent a bully maybe, but maybe you can t convince your kids to stand up to them when they occur, I don't know. It's the best way I can describe it. You know what I mean? And you know, I'm in a and I'm a straight white man at the end of the day too. So whatever bullying I experienced is probably a fraction of what so many other people can experience. You know what I mean? Uh. I really want something else. Sure, why not? Thick it up. Make it an extra thick. What do you got? Cookie. Wait, was that the boss? 
Kill two every time the board is refreshed. It's not bad. Refresh clear nearby pegs when hit. Also not bad. I don't know. I think we have a lot of refreshes. Go with that. Oh, this is the boss. Which is basically just a bigger version of that. Bam. 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 Hmm. Okay. It's a lot of damage. It's kind of overkill. Why did I do the Bramble? Maybe I should have skipped for it. I don't know. I don't think either way I would have reached the, the mouth, I guess, is one way of looking at it. So I don't think it mattered. Bramble probably won't work on this guy. Makes sense. Love that it's just a DPS race. Yeah, I kind of like it when they do that in games, at least to some degree. If it's like every single time, it's a bit much, though. Hmm. Try out the lightning over here. Jesus, look at it clear that board. It did it so fast, and when having the... Uh, the magnet, it was able to make good use of the magnet, kind of. Uh, I guess we use this, and then we double skip for Echo Orb. And I have a lot of damage. I was actually getting a lot of damage. We're working through all our problems today, Chad, that's for sure. <laughs> all right, Echo Orb. Let it out. I think they changed the songs a little bit or something. Uh, it didn't wind up being great. Should I not skip? Maybe I shouldn't skip this. It's still a 3-5 at the end of the day. Well, I'm probably still gonna have to reload at this rate, so it's kind of hard to say. Finally. Bullied by teacher's gang. Do I need to tell my Battletoad story again? <laughs> I'm still not over that just because I really want to know why it happened. I just want to know why it happened. Uh, okay. Not bad. Joke's on you, Dan. You help me through stuff every day. Nice. I need to work through it with a therapist. I don't really, like... The stream is my therapy to a degree, you know? I just let it... I, like, I don't really hold back any truths. You know what I mean? Okay. We should be fine. It's closer than I would have guessed. But we have a lot of AoE. Kind of. Chat is not therapy. Hmm. Time to... Time to get Twitch to unionize so I can get some benefits, so I can get some therapy going. Trauma dumping, not therapy. Yeah, I probably have some misconceptions here. Oh, come on. Ah, eh, don't worry about that, yo. I'm very- don't worry, I'm so like, I'm very aware of the, uh... What I need and stuff. I'm a good boy. Hmm... 30%? It's not bad. For the Metrobushka. 
Does that do anything special? It's just more damage to the Echo Orb. What do you got? Every shot has multi-ball one, but attacks at minus two, minus two. Eh, it could be worse. This one got slightly nerfed. I kind of just want to win so we can get the Crucible Ball, though. You know what I mean? So I still think the Cursed Mask is the best, kind of. Because the downside is barely a downside. Because I can't hit shit anyway, you know what I mean? That one's pretty terrible. All pegs have durable? Let's do that instead. More so for fun. Because I feel like I take the Cursed Mask too, too often. Wait, that's not the end of the run, is it? Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Whoa, 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 whoa. Haven't been able to get past this boss. A lot of AoE can help. I feel like the end boss stuff is still not, even though they tried to balance a lot of the things in the game, I still feel like it's not very well balanced and some things are just not very good. 50%. Let's do that. They changed the song here. Sounds good. Hmm. So when a therapist gets therapy, do they just vent about their patients to another therapist? <laughs> Kinda actually curious about this. But they also can't break, you know, hippo or whatever. Sometimes they can. <laughs> I mean, it shouldn't matter at the end of the day, right? I feel like the durable should be good with this lightning one, right? Damn, didn't quite kill them all. They're a special therapist, therapist. Gonna need some extra training. I assume their problems stem with work, so not stem from work. That's true. Well. I, I assume it's pretty rare that at least uh, an individual doesn't have some issues with their work, right? Uh, how much do we have to upgrade? A good amount. I'm gonna skip those. Hmm. I got a lot of shit to say to my therapist about Twitch chat. You know what I mean? Got a lot of venting to do over there. The number of times the name LK Composer comes up, you wouldn't believe. Double skip? Ooh, just to go into another rock? This is a bad start. I think we have to, though, kinda. Uh, Alright, so please hit that. Yeah! Oh, come on! This is kind of a tough board, I think, also. It's gonna be hard to hit these bombs. All right, we got one. All right, we got a few there. There, that should be a lot better now. Hopefully. Wrong. Hmm, didn't kill that much. Maybe I skip for Echo Orb here. Come on, hit some good stuff, please. Hmm, wasn't great. Huh. 
Pam, 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 pam. Have I played Rogue Legacy after the update? What do I think of it? I played it for the past like three weeks in a row. Almost the only thing I've played. <clears throat> I also have a dozen YouTube videos on it too. It's good. Simple. <laughs> Um, we'll do that. I can vent you about you all day, baby. Sounds good. Boop. It's always good to have someone, and it can be tough to have someone that, uh... Ooh, offer the stone. Yes, please. Very good. Ooh, Dagorb is now level two. It's good to ha and obviously not everyone has this. It's good to have someone just to vent to, to at the end of the day about things. To have these sort of discussion with. Not everyone has it. Oh, you talking about the updates from two days ago? Specifically? Yes, I, yeah, we were playing the past couple days. Uh, it was good. Like, a lot of the stuff didn't seem to matter that much. Like when they they're very gentle with the buffs, and which I actually think is correct. Their their process seems to be very gentle when they want to make changes with the game, which is fine by me. But it's it's uh it's where like I don't know if it really uh it do, it doesn't usually make a big difference. I think at the end of the day for a lot of the classes. So one of the big things was like the gunslinger got buffed, the mage got buffed, but I don't think those changes were like very major, personally. All right, that was a good turn. I am still shocked they did not touch the pirate. I think the pirate needs several, several loves. Bum, 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 ba, da, bum. Wrecked. Hmm. Good and high noon game plus. I mean, I'm on 13 and it still sucks ass. It has some, it has some, like the best that I can see is that it has okay exploration abilities in a sense in how it has range and stuff like that. But it's just so bad versus the bosses. You know what I mean? It's just so bad against any boss fight. Sure, if you get enough damage that the boss fight doesn't matter that much, that's good, but that, that the same thing goes for every single uh, class then, if that's the rule. On new game plus 25 here and Pirate is terrible, yeah, it's just not good, you know. Especially if you're under leveled, Pirate is just really bad. You know what I mean? Hey, Scarlet. Meme potential? Oh, it's got the meme potential. It's got the memes. I'm not saying that it has to change. Oh, there it is to the forest boss. Get wrecked, Blob. Get Prepare your holes, baby. Like, they can leave the pirate and I won't be that upset, but it's just kind of like, if they're going to change classes, if they're willing to change classes, I don't see why they wouldn't want to do something for the pirate here. Get wrecked. Um, let's take the heal there. What do you got? All orbs have persist plus one. Yes, please. You like the cannon with the dash crits? I mean, I it's better than Ranger, I think, in some ways. My issue is more so, like, the talent is useless. Like, the weapon is unique and different, which I can kind of like to some degree. Difficult to use, and it doesn't really feel fun when I try to play that style for me personally, but I'll allow the difference. But at the end of the day, the ship is a terrible talent. I truly believe.
My god, the screen shake. All right, we have persist. Uh Get that the brand ball and uh, have persist. We we're talking about Rogue Legacy 2. Not great. You can do better than that, baby. Come on. Get those refreshes. Thank you. Ugh. I forget what the pirate passive is. They could just make pirate like. Like, it's way too easy to skill crit with Barbarian, so they could make it more interesting by allowing the pirate to skill crit more easily, probably. They shouldn't be afraid to do that, at least, I think. And so, what you do is you just make it so the cannon, like, always crits to help with the bosses, or something like that. And sure, it's like, oh, well, that's a lot of damage. It's like, Barbarian is a shitload of damage anyway, so what's the big deal? More orbs. Go left. They could... Uh, the other thing, like, at least make it so the ship... Like, it's it makes sense. All the talents scale with intelligence. So why, why would the pirate be different? But they can make it part of the passive that their talent scales with strength or something like that. Increase your max HP by 15. Okay. Go left. Bum, bum, ba -dum, bum. Yeah, someone tried to tell me when I was doing my pirate only run that uh, it didn't seem to work as it said. Oh, Kane's free as pirates. Like, that's the biggest goddamn lie I've ever seen before in my life. Oh, come on. Get up there. No, get up there. I need you to go up. Stop going over there. All right, we'll get that crit over there. Oh, no. <sighs> Can't seem to get the critties. He hates in the first run? You can, yes. The speed run category. Check out Vareem. Oh, come on. I can't seem to get any of the crits ever. I can't seem to get it up here. Some people say Jonah's too easy. It's all conditional. Some glass, some classes are just better at some bosses than others, right? I think that's okay to have that be the case to a degree. I don't think Jonah's too easy. I mean, I don't think he was meant to be... I mean, it's right before Kane, so I think it's understandable it's not like... Some people might mistake it as this is meant to be the second hardest boss in the game, but I don't think you should really look at it from that perspective. Oh, wait, yeah. Maybe it's people thinking about the pri unprimed versions, because that I don't know. Boom, boom, ba -dum, boom. What am I doing? Upgrading? Bouncers contribute the damage. Pegboards start with two times as many bombs. That can be dangerous for us. But who cares, also? More trouble with Nama than Jonah? Hmm. Hey, Brady, buddy. It's hard to say which one I had more trouble. I don't know. Yeah, it, it kind of just depends on the class, I think, I've noticed. So, oh, dear God. How bad is that going to hurt? Oh, not that bad, really. Um, I kind of just don't want to hit anything. Please don't destroy a bunch of bombs. Save them for later. Save them for later! Go down! <laughs> hey, wow, it worked. Saving them for later! They buffed Pegnet again, didn't they? They did, yeah. A little bit. 
They're trying to balance things out. They seem to be having a tough time, though. Oh, boy. That's going to be spicy. Where's my healing orb? It's literally the last one in the deck. Well, that's probably not going to happen then. Oh, let's see. I need a hat. Oh. Oh, right. If the, they could make it so, um, after fighting Jonah, you don't get your health back and stuff. Or rather, maybe if you lose to Jonah, if you lose to Kane, you have to fight Jonah again. My God, what a bitch that would be. Now we're back to seafood. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what does that do? Not much. It's not much of an upgrade. Maybe I should have just healed there. Actual penis hat is probably TOS. I wonder. I have the ass hat. I, w mm, I wouldn't think it's TOS. It's kind of hard to say, though. Oh, come on. What was that? Ooh, get smoked, baby. And we have the heal orb up right after this. So go ahead and use it. Supposedly, you you can only have dildos on the stream if it's for educational purposes very explicitly. Like, I, you could get in, I could get in trouble just for simply having one in the background of the stream. Like, if I showed the whole room and there was a, there was a dildo somewhere on the shelf. I could get in trouble for that. But apparently, if you make it educational in some way, it's fine. <laughs> Which I'm actually fine with that. I'm not sitting here and saying like that's not fair for us dildo havers or something like that. But uh, I don't really care that much. But it is kind of like a weird line to draw in some ways. It is hard to also please something like that. Yeah, there's naked people doing yoga on YouTube. Yep. You can go wake up, look up a Brazilian wax or something, too. Oh, it got filtered. See, you can't s discuss dildos, Detroit. What if it's in the background with arrows labeling the different parts of the dildo? Maybe that could work. <laughs> hey, Kistra. You have to cup the balls. Cup the balls. Hmm. Refill a bus or one of the boards refresh deal damage to target enemy equal to the number of pegs restored. Oh, I've never seen that one, I think. That sounds pretty cool, actually. Bum 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 ba -dum, ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum. I only have like the stone to upgrade, right? Hey, everything's gonna be level three. Teach me, Dan? I don't know. I, I don't know my way around the dick, really. I'll be the first to admit it. Do I want to use a dag orb? What, how does the brand ball... Brand ball probably just doesn't work on bosses. So there's kind of no point in using it. So I guess I just use the dag orb then. Don't get stuck. Lagged a little there. How did it go up to 6,000 so fast? One. Hmm. Okay, right here. Bonk. Crit right away. How did it get up to 6,000 so quickly? Don't get stuck. No, 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 no. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving! I was about to get very upset. Oh, it's so buggy. Okay. All right. Yeah, how did that one time it went up so high so fast? I don't know. 
Ring. Bonk. Yeah, I should do carry ball, carry all damage, carry over damage, whatever it is. I think the bombs are glitchy or something. But uh, it won't actually make them get stuck, I'd imagine. Bum, 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 bum. They really hit the nail on the head with, like, making an over-the-top game like this, in a way. Ow. Okay, send it back to Mama. We're out of busies. Oh, come on, you got stuck right away. <sighs> Bomb starting a bunch of pegs and refreshing. Oh, combined with the durable. I guess that's what it was, huh? So the bombs just wound up being really monstrous. There we go! Crucible level one unlocked, I guess. Yay! Huzzah! Unfortunately, we don't have time to play it. So what does it show up as now? C? Oh, you turn on. Start each run with plus one stone. Stones have minus zero, minus one. That's a pretty tough debuff to start. I gotta say.